Start game with default settings. Yes. Hopefully that doesn't mean normal mode, which is going to absolutely devastate us. Project Zero, by the way, is, is what they call these in Japan, I believe. Fatal Frame 2, Crimson Butterfly. We got new game, we got load game, we got album, we got gallery, we got options. Alright. Subtitles on, please. No game data found. Create game data. It takes a little while. It's got to create a, a space. The reason why it does that is, I believe, I don't know if this one's like the first one, but in the first game, there's no real, like, loading. Basically, whenever you open a door, it holds the door for a little bit and then opens, and that's how they, like, load areas. So the whole game, like, loads inside the game. That's why that takes so long for that save, I believe. All right. New game. All right. There is easy and normal. I'm tempted to go easy, because when we did normal on the, on the first game, it kicked the crap out of us. I'm not gonna lie. Let me, let me check to see if there's something that's tied to endings for this real quick. Okay. Nope. It does not matter which, which one we do it on. I have to go back and watch a playthrough of one then. I'm tempted to see how bad. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm very torn here. Because we, we survived one. But surviving and having fun are two drastically different things. Just saying. You know what? We gave one a shot on normal. We'll give two a shot. It doesn't matter. The, uh, you can go easy and not tell us all. It's fine. We'll go normal. Because I, I, I do want to do more of a direct comparison. Because a lot of people said that this one is so much better. So I want to compare the normal to normal here. Because if I'm going to recommend... If I'm going to recommend this one over the other one, I want to be able to have that comparison. <clears throat> we would always be together. Mayu. Okay, I'm guessing that's... Either that's our character's name, or that's who we're looking for. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, looks like Mayu fell off a cliff. We used to play here all the time. Yeah. All of this will be gone soon. Is your leg okay? Does it hurt? It does a little bit. I'm fine. Mia? Yes? Never mind. Also, how are you doing today, False? Hopefully you're doing well. Interesting. Mayu! Where are you going? 
Oh, we crossed the threshold of some, like, spiritual barrier. And now she's limping. Also, we just saw her in a Shrine Maidens. Interesting. Okay. So it seems like we might have more of a direct connection to the story here instead of a, uh, like, kind of a outwardly connection. Because the, in the first game, you play a character who's connected to a character who's connected to the image from the, the main antagonist. So, but this one, it seems like they're direct connection. So two things I noticed. One, their eyes are red. Also, two, on the cover of this game, there are two Shrine Mans tied together. So, uh... I think that's going to play a part. All right. Let's see. Can we move the camera? All right. We got, let's see. We got map. We don't have map. Okay. Fair enough. Items. No items. Don't have any photos. No files. No memos. Can't move the camera, so I don't know why I'm in this, like, really weird low area low perspective there. So. As a Tory gate. I'm so sorry. Oh, Crimson Butterfly. It's the title of the game. Well, it's the subtitle of the game. Where is this? Interesting. Okay. Was the butterfly again? Mayu? Uh huh. The lost village. Wait for him too. Catch some butterfly. There you go. All right. here that disappeared during a festival. People who get lost in the woods are trapped by the village. Could this be that place? The lost village. Okay. I heard singing before, but... Nobody here. Just trying to see. Oh, you could save it lanterns? Interesting. That's not what I was expecting to save at. Tori gate is now broken. So we cannot leave from whence we came. So is this rope snapped? Town like stone pillars lined up around a pestle, some kind of altar. Yep. Oh. Seen those before. Torch is lit, someone must have been. So we don't have our camera just yet. I'm very curious how they're gonna... Wait. Okay, so she stumbles because of her leg injury. Statue of a guardian deities appear to be carving of twins. Seem to be many statues like this throughout the village. 
Okay, so let's not run as much, I guess. Um, but I'm very curious how they're going to sell that there's another spirit camera. Because before it was connected directly to the story and the, pe and the fact that there was a piece of a holy mirror in it. But I'm very curious how they handle that here. Also, it seems very dark for you guys. I don't know why my capture stuff is always so dark for you guys. There we go. That's a little washed out. Okay, so that's about what I see. I wish I would have figured that out for Silent Hill. Silent Hill was super dark. The rope bridge boards are old. It'll probably be dangerous to cross it without a light. Should probably find another path. It looks like a cemetery. Okay, so we, we need to find a torch. Yeah, that's much better. Should we check out that village? I mean, I'm trying. They told me not to go across the rope bridge without a torch. I tried to grab this one. It won't let me do anything. So I guess we gotta go this way? Ah, okay. No? This is the... Uh... What is she looking at? She was looking like right here. Oh, you could bump into her. That's interesting. Alright. Looks like there's an item down here. Something on the ground. Black bag. There are several pieces of paper and a photo inside. News clipping. News clipping from a year ago. Headline, Geological Surveyor Missing. The start of the construction of the All God's Dam approaching. Masumi Makimura, a geological surveyor dispatched to the area, has gone missing. Mr. Makimura went to the area to investigate the site that would be submerged once the dam was built, but hasn't been heard from for five days. The search for Masumi, the surveyor since missing since the 4th of this month, came to a close yesterday. Mr. Makimura had been helping the con to conduct the geological survey for All God's Dam. As of yesterday, he has been missing for 10 days. Okay. Who's this, I wonder? Who else is here? Okay, so they were going to build a dam. I'm guessing that would wash away this town. And, uh, they went to go investigate the town, and the town ate them. Oh, someone's down there. Hello! Cutscene? Yeah. I wonder if anyone's here. Hmm. Uh oh. <laughs> that was not our, uh, yeah. I guess, sister's hand. Yeah. Spooky. Oh, hi there. I, I legitimately can't do anything to you right now. Got a phone call as soon as I enter chat. At least the game has better voice acting. No, I admit the VA and one was charming. I mean, voice acting doesn't really bother me. It, it's like... 
there's just there's a lot of people with a lot of different styles and also back in the day you know playstation 1 playstation 2 there wasn't a lot of voice direction it was more like here's some lines read these okay but send the game out you know okay so she sees something Mayu, what's wrong Ooh. Getting all sorts of flashes of information here, so. I don't want to kill anyone. Okay, so the surveyor killed a woman, it looks like. <clears throat> Interesting. What was that? I don't know. I don't know. Interesting. Can we interact with her outside of... Okay. Nope. Did not mean to do that. Interesting. Neo, don't go too far. I'm literally right here and walking. Give me a second. Woman's notebook. I've heard rumors about the lost village before. Long ago, a massacre occurred on the day of a ceremony, and the village was wiped from the map. Twin deities, statues, and the forest lead lost people to the village entrance. Once you pass through the gate, however, you cannot go back. The village eternally re relives that night of death. The insane laughter of a woman is said to echo throughout the village. The only survivor of the massacre at the village was a lone woman. Okay, so very similar to the Calamity. But I don't think Kiryu or Kyrie survived the Calamity, so that's a little bit of a change. Okay, we got stairs up. Trying to make sure we check everything. She really just wants to stand right in front of us. I don't want to miss anything. Okay, we could go down that way. That's where the thing told us to go. Is this a door? Can we interact with this? Oh, it is a door. Okay. Uh, it's blocked. Oh, no, it's not. We can squeeze on in here. We got another item up oh, and a save lantern. Can you pick up the item, please? Woman's Notebook 2. Sometimes I sense someone passing by the window. He carries a torch and mutters things. He seems to be searching for somebody, but it's not Masumi. At a distance, I can hear some kind of sad ceremonial song being sung. They say that this village vanished on the day of a ceremony, and that the day is repeated over and over again. Alright, so we're looking for red lanterns. Those are our save points. Okay. Okay, do we have a map now? Are we, like, making it... Okay, we are making it as we travel. Got it. Interesting. I feel like we're being watched by someone. Well, that's... That's great. Why did you have to say it like that? Ooh, sacred water. A lot of women's kimonos in here, apparently. Let's head up the stairs.
Oh. Padlock with a family crest representing ginger on the door. Interesting. Okay. That's a uh, very like Resident Evil. So something tells me our sister is going to get grabbed by a ghost or something. And we're going to have to like go hunt for her. At least I think they're sisters. It's not really been confirmed one way or the other. Okay, yeah, that's this way. Alright. Let's go that. Okay. Well, we know which way it wants. Well, we know which way it wants us to go. Is the closet... What does it say? Try to interact with something that it said no. Oh, I'm pushing X too much. Seems to be locked. Okay. So you can't spam X like you could in the first game. Alright. All the ghosts. That's always safe. It's a bit cold. Yes, but there's ghosts in here. What do you expect? Looks like an old coat. There's dust inside that hasn't been used in a long time. There's an item over here. Notebook 3. Masumi, it's me, Miyako. I came to look for you. Let's go home together. Together we can make it. Call for me if you find this. I'll be nearby. Miss you. Okay. I wonder if anyone's really here. You know, if you keep asking questions like that, you're going to get an answer. And you're not going to like it. You've got to get out of my way. How do we get down? Are there not just stairs right here? can't really see anything. Blasters come loose because of the moisture outside. Okay. Uh, map time. What does map say? Okay. So we need to go. There's a doorway. No, that door was locked. So I guess we need to go this way? It's interesting that it doesn't mark locked doors. Ah. So I'm guessing that's because this door is now unlocked because of the ghost. Yep. I was like, that door was definitely locked. Okay, we got an item on the table and an item. Strange about this place. Flashlight on the table? Camera obscura pointers. Camera pointers. This camera was made by... This is not a camera, it's a flashlight. Anyways, it was made by Dr. Osso to take photographs of beings in a spiritual plane that normally cannot be seen. It can reveal events from the past through the lingering thoughts of individuals. It's also able to pho photograph spiritual beings that are invisible to the human eye. Taking a photo of an unseen being has excisimal effect and simultaneously creates a sort of link with them. As the camera obscura is used curiously, these beings may even gain the upper hand on the user. I wonder if I can photograph the site at the heart of this village's forbidden ritual. If Dr. Asso were here, I'm sure he'd be excited. Seijiro Kabe. It's much older than the flashlight. It seems to be originally from this house. 
But we didn't get a camera, we just got a flashlight. Ah, there's the camera. Okay, so their way of bringing it back is that someone else invented a spirit camera. We're definitely going to get grabbed reaching for that. Yes, but you're gonna need that camera to see them. Oh, okay. Basic camera operation. A uh, special camera to take photographs. Filament in the bottom right of the window or... Okay, hold on. When you face the direction where the spirit is, the filament at the bottom right of the window or the top of the viewfinder will glow. Once you've located a spirit, raise the camera with a circle button. When you found a spirit, center it with a view and press the shutter button. X or R1, so it's the same. Okay. Wait, is there no film for the camera? Oh yeah, okay, so there is film. We have Type 1448. We have additional features. We've got range. Oh, range, accumulation, and sensitivity. Those are different. And you got a power-up lens. Okay, so they've changed this a little bit. I'm gonna go in here. Grab this item. Herbal medicine. Please move. Please move. Thank you. <laughs> okay. So this was the door they were looking at. Door woman. Oh, so they actually give you points for taking those pictures now. They, they didn't do that in the first game. Gone. The first game, if you took those pictures, it would just be like, Come you on, have a name. And then, like, that's it. Mm -hmm. That's cool. I like that. That's a nice addition. Presence you're feeling in front of the door is now gone. You said to capture things where the ordinary people can't see with this camera. Could this be the power of the camera obscura? Uh, yes. But it also means now they're attracted to you. Because they know you know. Okay. 